How's it going guys and welcome back to the channel today. So today we're going to continue reacting to Black Clover. Good lord, that last episode was one of the craziest episodes. I actually think it was the craziest episode. We saw the climax of Mars and Asta facing off. We saw Asta come out with essentially a new sword, a shorter sword, but he seemed to be able to borrow Noel's power to overcome Mars, but it ended up in tragedy almost it seems you know asta has got a huge wound in fact he's been impaled by this huge like mineral cluster inside of him and it looks absolutely messed up i'm hoping he can get healed but already the group are in a bit of a bad state as it is as well with noel down um uh, with Mimisa already trying to heal her, so I don't know how it's going to happen, you know, how they're going to get out of this situation. Is this the end of the dungeon now as we know it? You know, is Mars really done? I don't know, but I can't wait to find out. Remember, if you would like to see me react to the next episode, make sure that you hit the like button on this video and let me know down in the comments below. As always, it is up to you guys if these videos continue. You know, if they do well enough, I will always continue to make them, but it is all down to you. And if you would like to see the full uncut versions of these videos with improved visuals and audio, as well as uh, Naruto, uh, ReZero, and a bunch of other movies and cool stuff like that, my Patreon is live and down in the description below. We also have early access over there, so everything comes out over there way before YouTube. So if you would like to see that, the link is down below. And lastly, I do live anime reactions over on Twitch every single Monday and Friday as well, where we do episode reactions. We also do movie reactions and a bunch of other cool stuff. So if you want to check that out, the link to my Twitch is down in the description below. Make sure you go over there, hit that follow button, helps your boy out, but it also means that whenever we do go live, you won't miss out. All right, without further ado, let's get straight into this shit. So guys, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and let's get it. Yeah, he looks like he needs priority right now. Yeah, some interesting backstory for him now. Interesting. Oh, he's still there. Fana. Oh god, of course they had to fight against each other. Oh my god. Jesus, this is so dark. Oh. Good lord, man. This is messed up. Oh. Ah, uh, this is cruel. It's either fight against each other or die. Just think about how, like, that would disturb you. How that would absolutely haunt you. Jesus, like, I'm so glad that we're getting some character development for him and he's not just some villain of the week or something. This is a really, really interesting concept, but it's also probably the darkest thing that we've seen so far coming out of this show. And I really kind of love it when a show will take risks and dive into sort of topics like that. And it kind of just gives you a little bit more uh, of a dimension to his personality. Why it is that he is like this? And, you know, of course, he was probably going to go crazy later on in life. And you can see that's why he kind of became unhinged because he seemed like a normal child, but they've been grown in this kind of horrific manner. They haven't had a childhood. They've been killing other children for their own survival. And not only is it just her that he's killed, he's probably killed many other kids and people since he's left as well. So, Christ. <laughs> Oh, interesting. Is that why his grandma was com looked like it was stitched together and like combined? Yes, that makes sense now. Oh, good lord. Oh. Oh, yes, you know. Come on, lad. Oh, let's go. What? Is he just frozen time or slowed it down? What? 
What the hell? Who is this? Oh, damn. <laughs> Christ. Was it that spell that he found on the scroll earlier on that got wiped? Maybe. Jesus. I knew it! I knew it! Okay, so does that mean he could be able to call on that sword in the future? Yeah, he's added to his Grimoire. Wow, that's sick. Okay, now this looks like the whole place is coming down. Pull your tongue out and leave. Get out. God, the whole thing is coming down. Mate, you know, just coming in so clutch, though. Save him. Christ. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. They make it? I'm sure they did. Come on. They made it. Hell yeah. Ah, uh, these guys. And they got him out. That was so intense. I mean, but the, the sad thing is when you look at it from both, you know, uh, the groups, you know, you look at it from uh, Golden Dawn and from the Black Bulls perspective, they really got nothing out of that. In fact, they just got injured. They went in there. They retrieved nothing. The, the all everything that was in there fell into the hands of the diamond kingdom i think it's the diamond kingdom or the diamond people that it fell into their hands the only thing that they can say that they got out of it is asta got a new fucking badass sword and you know got this crazy ability out of that scroll i don't know the, the how that came out but that was such an overpowered like that was key to all of this um but th this is going to be interesting to see what's going to go forward. Obviously, I'm hoping, I actually hope that we see more of Mars in the future as well. Now that we know that he did make it out, because I feel, I feel like he's a really, really interesting character already. And just the, the, the idea of what he's been through is really crazy. So I'm really kind of hoping that we get to see him later on, get a little bit more character development out of him. And it'd be interesting to see more between... Uh, the kingdoms. I, I'm really liking this kind of whole idea, how that's now been introduced and we get to see a little bit more of that kind of stuff. You know, like how intense is it? Are we going to go into the lore of that a little bit more? Are we going to see more of the tensions there? Um, so this is going in the, the Black Clover. I'm so, so glad because this show for me just keeps getting better and better and i know you guys keep saying you know early the early stuff isn't that great it gets better and better but i've really really enjoyed the early stuff so far so if, if it only keeps getting better and better which it just really is i'm enjoying these reactions so much um more than a lot of the other series that we've done so uh, i'm just excited just to see keep on going because it's just going in the right direction right now But what he doesn't know is that they planned on saving him as well. Oh! So wholesome! Look at this shit, man! Oh man, that, that gets me in the feels, man. That, that, that's the highlight of this episode so far. Hell yes, man. Man, what an episode. God damn. I actually think that that was probably my favorite episode of Black Clover so far. So much happened. Everything, like, it had everything. It had action. It had character development on insane levels. It had emotional moments. Um, it had moments where it tells more about the future of the story of where we're going to go. But what, for me, was going to be interesting is to see how now the dynamics are going to change between those two groups you know will word spread about the black bulls and how instrumental they were in that will people still see them as these peasants because you know if the golden dawn have recognized them well at least one of them or two of them have recognized that well three really um 
surely that is going to have a knock-on effect as well it'll also be interesting to see what's going to happen with the future with mars now that now that he is awake he seems to have had a kind of emotional awakening as well the fact that he thanked lotus there as well which is apparently something that he never does but i'm also interested to see the more you know what more between the kingdoms what's going to happen there where do we go next because it looks like now that that dungeon arc is over and and for the first arc experience of black clover i think it's been fantastic i really really enjoyed it and if that is just a small taster of what is to come you know people say wait until you get to episode so and so so and so it gets crazy so if this is just you know just a little bit i cannot wait to see uh what is going to come next remember if you would like to see me react to the next episode of this series make sure that you hit that like button and let me know down in the comments below you know if this show does well enough on the youtube channel my patreon and and everything else you know i will continue to make them but it is all down to you guys so let me know and like i said if you would like to see the full uncut version of these videos my patreon is live and down in the description below they also come out way before anywhere else so if you want to check that out the link to that is down in the description below but until next time guys take care of yourselves and i'll see you soon peace